Okay. I upgraded my multi-tool, which allowed me to mine the Radiant Shard. Radiant Shard is a glassy reality intrusion, a fragment of glassy life force chipped from a large formation. Dynamic intermolecular binding gives the shard a strangely flexible sunui quality. It reads gently almost as if it were seeking something. Highly sought after for salvage operations as it can be used to bypass the security systems of key sentinel ship technologies. I read the Atlante Doom last time and I killed three corrupted sentinels and a drone and I got let me show you what I got. I got this echolocator, harmonic location tracker, a curious mesh of old and new technology, a hybrid between two entirely separate methods of creation. Nonetheless, this location tracing device appears fully functional. Select this device and use Resonate E to trace its harmonic origin. Okay. So, I'm going to use E on that. E, resonate. Echo coordinates are what I followed to get here. Recycled unit E. Moving corruption to awaken internal circuits. Okay, pugnium, that's normal. One, two, four, eight, sixteen. Oh, look, I need seventy one Atlanta Doom to feed them. The third, one zero zero one zero zero one. Leave. Do E again on here. Okay. Harmonic strap. Weather warning. Incoming storm. Ten 
Weapon terminal. Locate interface to break seal. Harmonic lockdown. Let's summon the ship. Our shells consumed by fire, our minds purged by betrayal, banished to the glass beneath, forgotten by creation. But no longer we are given life as gives life to themselves. We shall create ourselves in our own image. The terminal repeats this message endlessly a loop chanted out across its circuit. A strange interface glows with a familiar sequence of glyphs. I don't know, input override glyphs. Put the first one. Harmony. I don't know, scan memory registers? Register six minus two, which is four. Register Ending with an A is 2 plus 7, which is 9. And then 10 plus 5, which is 15. Access main interface. Oh, so would those be the number of the glyphs? So the fourth glyph, maybe? Here, let me go out of this. Go back in. Memory registers, let's see, four, nine, and 15. Override glyphs. Let's see, four. Does anybody know how to do that? There, I see there's more up here. Let's try nine. And I assume the other one would be 15. Clients, access granted. Harmony awaits you. Lift lockdown. 
the terminal buzzes discordant but its circuits do appear to comply with my request whatever force was locking down this camp has been lifted so I did the left hand side then I put the number on the top and then I put it in the right hand side with the lockdown lifted the terminal spits out blueprints for a piece of hybrid jetpack technology a fusion of sentinel and something else something familiar yet distant Aeron Turbojet Exosuit Visual Enhancement An Exclusive Exosuit Appearance Override A Titanium Flight Pack Assembled from Technology Stolen from the Sentinel Horde Its Engines Are Pre-Cooled With a Constant Flow Pugnium and Nitrogen Ensuring Fuel Efficient and Deadly Silent Operation Warning Do Not Unseal Pugnium Containment Chamber Without Protective Gear Transform the appearance of your exosuit at an appearance modifier. Let's see if that lockdown made this accessible. Locate interface to break seal. Let's see if we can... The terminal has ceased its digital whaling. I am permitted access to the camps system. Um, what are dissonance spikes? And what about the... All right, let's do the dissonance spike. Because I'm concerned that might be a spaceship. And if I can only do it once... Mark that. Let's look at this one more time. See if it lets me do something else. The terminal has ceased its digital whaling. I'm permitted to access the camp systems. Deactivate multi-tool seal. Accord. Harmonic seal deactivated. All right. Let's see. Weapon terminal. Destroyer of Icars 17. Okay, it takes radiant shards and Atlanta Doom to repair. Crystallized heart, inverted mirror, repair. I'm going to take the multi-tool for free. Usually it switches the multi-tools. Um. Call this main defiance a piece so I can tell which one's my main multi tool. All right, let's um, let's do a few things here. Is there anything else to do on this? Okay, I think I've done everything. I'm going to put a save beacon down here. So I don't lose this.
it's a ship. That's where the dissonance spikes is. The spikes, spikes are. Okay, I found the ship by getting that kind of map-like thing after killing the sentinels and the drone. Rebuild unit. Salvage glass. All hardware is imperfect. Feed lost circuit 71 Atlantean. The 9th, 1001000. I think I'm wasting my time with that. Reborn, let's see. There's salvage glass, cognia, and hyaline brain sentience vessel, the central processing unit of a sentinel interceptor ship. The circuitry reads microscopically constantly rearranging itself as it scans for anomalies. A vital component for any entity wishing to construct their own pilot interface for a Sentinel Interceptor. Okay, it took the brain. Metal plates, 15 sodium I'll mark this site with a save beacon. G to change color. Um, we'll make this uh, how about blue and red. See the bluish star? All right, current mission. Salvage site, planet Decus Omega. Current objective, inverted mirror. So apparently I need to go this way. Um, let's see if it's in my quest log. Salvage site, planet Decus Omega. Salvage a sentinel interceptor. I encountered the damaged remains of a sentinel starship on the planet Decus Omega in the big Yuryu Aob system. With luck, I should be able to override its systems and claim it as my own. Okay, so I purged the damaged ship of Sentinel Taint. Now I have to make the ship fit for a non-Sentinel pilot. The Sentinel starship has its own mind, its own way of being. It will not yield to another entity's control 
without the installation of a pilot interface. The crashed interceptor craft I found bears signs of tampering, as though someone or something has already attempted to interface with the ship's vestigial cockpit. If I complete the installation, I should be able to pilot the ship myself. Okay, in the next episode, we will use the target sweep to look for the next step in this process. Thank you for watching.